Hey, what's up everyone? So in today's exercise, we're going to use a massage ball to the chest. Now, this is a great corrective exercise when it comes to having a lot of tightness in the chest, but mostly shoulder pain, okay? Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to use this massage ball here. Uh, this one I have is called a cryo ball. You, if you want something like this, it's really cold and it really helps with inflammation. You can get it on my website at bodyhcfitness.com, but you can use any type of ball, like a baseball, a regular massage ball, uh, the ones with spikes, whatever, okay? But I particularly like this one, okay? Now, when it comes to using this massage ball, especially to relieve a lot of tightness out of the chest, right? Because when it comes to shoulder pain, most of it is usually coming from a tight chest because your shoulders are uh, rotated inward, okay? So what we need to do is try to release that tightness so your shoulders can be able to go back because this, to have good posture, you wanna be like this, okay? So what first thing you're gonna do is go ahead and take a massage ball and you probably wanna come a lot closer so people can really see this. Um, you wanna place the ball right here to the chest, right? And how, how it works is because the muscles of the chest goes laterally, right? So you wanna move according to the muscle fibers. So as you see, I'm gonna put the ball in place and then just kind of guide it and I wanna place pressure, okay? Now when it comes to the pressure, uh, if you want more pressure, just push more against to the wall. If less pressure, don't push as much. As simple as that. But one of the things you wanna do is like if you feel a hot spot. A hot spot is like where it hurts the most and it's gonna be really tight. Now, most of the hot spots in a lot of people are usually here, all right? Right between the socket of the shoulder and the chest where it connects, right? So what you wanna do is place it right there and then hold it there for a couple of seconds, probably like 15, 20 seconds, okay? Hold it there for a little bit. And when you hold it, this is gonna actually disengage the chest muscle, okay? So it's gonna actually relieve a lot of tension because that's where the pain is actually coming from if you have shoulder pain. And then you wanna go ahead and start rolling laterally on the chest. Now, if it hurts all, like, all over your chest when you're doing it and you can't really withstand the pain, that's a, a big signal that your chest is really tight, okay? And you wanna, you wanna really uh, start using the massage ball more. So again, this is why you could use different types of balls because this one's like made out of steel, so it's very hard. So it's, it's really applying a lot of pressure to my chest, right? But I can still talk to you and be able to do the exercise because it's not that painful, okay? But with the coldness of the ball, it should help relieve a lot of the pain because you're just gonna feel the temperature of the ball, okay, mostly, all right? And then that's it, okay? Now, you, once you're finished doing on one side, go ahead and work on the other side, and then you're pretty much done, okay? But that's how you do uh, or use a massage ball for the chest.